Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes here on my channel. Today I am excited to share with you a lovely bi-monthly subscription that has been once again sent to me for review. It is of course Tea Pray Love, which looks like it's gotten a little update on the colorway of the box. It just happens to match my blouse very well today. They have two different box sizes, the petite box as well as the premier box, as well as a few other things that you get to customize when you first subscribe. So the petite box is still just $29.95 plus shipping. I believe the shipping is $6.95. The Premier box is $42.95 plus shipping. The main difference between the two is usually in the Premier box there are a couple more items. Sometimes the items come in larger quantities and then finally there is usually a book or a journal included as well as part of your self-care in a box. And of course there's also the option now for coffee in either the Petite or the Premier boxes. So it could be coffee pray love as well. And then finally, they ask you what your favorite teas are, if you like white tea, black tea, uh, green tea, for example, and when possible, they will try to go with those preferences. They also ask your skin type because we get a lot of skin care in this box as part of those self-care products. So they will try to work with that as well if you have, for example, very sensitive or oily or combination skin. So I think that's really cool. And I have to tell you guys, the value on this box is so fantastic. Not only do they give you a good two months to use the products to enjoy them to maybe read through the book they also have just like when you add up the value on the items in this box, it is so good compared to what you are paying. So I do have a code for you. It's Noel15. That will, of course, save you 15%. And as always, I'll leave all of that information for you in the description box below. But let's go ahead and open it up. So inside they have their little pamphlet. They always just do such a good job of sort of giving us the vibe of the box for the month. Sorry, you guys can't get it to focus on me. Let me see if I can get it to focus on that maybe maybe there we go okay and then inside we usually have a message from Chinwe, the owner and then they give us the rundown on all of the products letting us know what items are different in the petite or premier boxes letting us know what items are in the coffee boxes instead of tea so i usually try to go through and read that and make it as clear as possible we do have a quote to start off for July. It says, all we need really is a change from a near frigid to a tropical attitude of mine. And that is from Marjorie Stoneman Douglas. And then here's our message from Jeanway. It says, what is a tropical attitude of mind? Well, I'd like to think of it as free and alive. It's also an attitude of pure bliss and of course, warmth. While it is difficult to attain this attitude of mind at all times, especially if you don't exactly live in the tropics, we hope that you can find that space this season. May this July Live curation bring you a bit of sunshine energy and tropical tranquility tea of course so all right i'm gonna keep this in front of me so that we can kind of reference it as we get into our box and this is what we've got there's usually some shred as well as this nice little foam i love that this time around it looks like they were actually able to fit everything into the box sometimes when you know boxes have to really cram everything in that box the outer box gets even more damaged and I am a bit of a stickler, you guys. You know, I do take photographs of a lot of the boxes that I receive here, and then I post those images over on Instagram. So I always like products to come in as pristine condition as possible because uh, wrinkly packages just don't look so pretty. All right, I'm just trying to pull some things out. Looks like my book might have gotten an itty bit squished, but that way I can kind of go through things in the right order that they are listed and not kind of like hop around and get lost because sometimes that's how you uh, kind of forget to mention things. All right, looks like I've gotten my box empty. That's a good sign. Let's go ahead and talk about our featured tea. So it is a returning fave. It is Nelson's Tea Company. Indeed, they are a favorite. Um, so we always get um, really nice loose leaf tea from them. It's cherry coconut pineapple, you guys. It's a black tea blend. It says it has medium caffeine. Let me read you the description. It says, just like the sweet summer ambrosia salad, this brew is full of sweet fruity flavor and is especially enjoyable iced. It sounds good. I love a fruity iced tea and that sounds perfect for a nice hot day like today. It has an $11.95 value. I do appreciate it because you guys can maybe see that loose leaf tea in there. Nice black tea. So this is the size in the premier box. In the petite boxes, 
they wound up with a slightly lesser value so it was a five dollars and 80 cent value so that's about half so i'm guessing that they got a one ounce bag instead of this two ounce bag for example it says this is from nelson's it says nelson's tea small batch handcrafted artisan teas was established in 12 2012 and fully launched in january 2016 wow it took them like four years to like develop and, and finally launch. It says loose leaf tea blends are our central focus. At Nelson's Tea, we serve both wholesale and online retail customers. However, most of our business is derived on the wholesale side, serving cafes, boutiques, gift shops, offices, salons, kombucha companies, and tea houses with loose leaf tea blends internationally. So if you've never heard of it, it's just because they usually are working more on a wholesale basis. All right, we also got some tea drops, which are in this cute little bag, which are always really fun because you just drop those in the water and you don't even have to worry about it. So this has a $2 value. So you either got blueberry acai like I did, or you got citrus ginger tea. Wow, those both sound amazing. Drop your tea drop into your cup and add four ounces of boiling water. Stir, then pour over a cup of Stir, then pour over a cup of ice and add four ounces of cold water. Voila, you have iced blueberry acai tea made with organic white peony tea, organic blueberries and organic acai berries, or iced citrus ginger made with organic lemon, organic orange and organic ginger. Each tea drop is encased in a convenient single serve packaging to be enjoyed anytime, anywhere. So I like that as a tip to really get that flavor to come out. You wanna go ahead and put it in half hot water, the boiling water like you would normally and then go ahead and pour that over ice and add more cold water so you know you want it to kind of bloom essentially with the hot water first so that is definitely an important tip then we also got it looks like we got a Vitamasks pineapple glow serum Ooh, this is gonna be good you guys so this has a $17.99 value so look at I think this is it yes pineapple you guys I love me some pineapple it says enhance your natural glow this summer with this lightweight tropical serum what it is a V vegan friendly hydrating glow enhancing serum featuring pineapple extracts MMHA vitamins and golden light reflectors ooh golden light reflectors why it's special it's formulated with multi molecular hyaluronic acid complex pro vitamin B5 and natural extracts for a perfect dewy skin look that all sounds awesome to me so and very summery in terms of the color of it as well love that all right, so, so far that was also in the Petite and Premier boxes. Then we also got something from Bubble Tea Cosmetics, which they've been using them a little bit more, and I've been seeing them in more boxes too. This is a watermelon body scrub, so this has a $6.50 value. The Vitamasks, if I didn't mention it, had a $17.99 value. So it says, boost your summer shower routine with this watermelon body scrub. This refreshing scrub is formulated with nourishing ingredients and smells refreshing to give you that extra lift to start your day. This fruity body scrub is vegan friendly, SLS and paraben free, meaning no nasties whatsoever. Simply apply to your skin and gently rub away any rough or bumpy areas. The refining ingredients also help lock in moisture for skin that feels soft. I love a body scrub in a tube. Some of you guys have probably heard me say that before versus the ones that come in a jar and I just feel like they're kind of messy. I really like when it's integrated into almost like a lotion or a body wash because I feel like it works a little bit better and it's not quite as granulated. So I'm looking forward to that. So this is the 650 value. And again, this like both of these items, you know, it's not like you got less in the petite box or missed out on one of these items in the petite box. So let's see what else we have. We also got, so they often include a drinkware of some sort. So that's what this is. Now I will admit, uh, honestly, just but it could be because I get so many subscription boxes as a reviewer. I don't necessarily need drinkware from any box. It kind of makes more sense, in honesty, from T Pray Love, in honest T E T E A. But I'm like, personally, unless it's a gorgeous mug, like gorgeous, it has to be has to be really fancy because my have a new mug rule is kind of like the rule I should have with my closet, where like. If I keep a mug, I have to get rid of a mug. And sometimes that's really hard because I've been very selective over the years. So I kind of feel that way with glassware, especially when it's not matched, especially when it's just a one-off glass like this. It's super cute though. I appreciate that they actually sent us a glass. Ooh, oh yeah, a glass versus like plastic. I'm not into the plastic tumblers. This is from Slant Collections, which does a lot of fun drinkware and like kind of party items. This is cute though, it's double walled. Is it plastic? No, this is glass. It's just like a, it sounds, it sounds or it feels 
really lightweight for being glass. So it says made for sunny days, kind of like in a copper with an orange. I mean, it's beautiful. It's fun. It'd be fun to drink your iced tea in or glass of wine. But you know, for me, I'm like, I just like things like if I had four different colors with four different sayings on it and it was a set, not that I have room for that in my house. I don't. But if I did, it would probably be more likely to like live in my house for a little bit longer, if that makes sense. I just, I have open cabinets um, and I eventually want to have more open shelving, but I have cabinets with windows. So I like things to look like they're in sets instead of just super mismatched. We already have a very mismatched set of uh, pint glasses from different breweries that my husband and I have gone to. And like for me, that is enough mismatching. <laughs> This has a $20 value, so yes, glass. It says, sip your iced tea or iced coffee in style with this made for sunny day stemless glass. Get the added benefit of functionality with the double wall design, which keeps your beverages cooler longer and keeps the outer glass at a comfortable temperature to touch. Hand wash only, probably because of the lettering here. All right, so that was everything that is in both boxes. The only difference, of course, is the Petite and Premier have different sizes of tea. Now, if you got the uh, coffee box, you would have gotten Twin Engine Coffee with a $6 value in the Premier boxes, a $3 value in the Petite, as well as a coffee medley. So that sounds fun. I used to get the coffee when I was a subscriber, but um, just so that I can show you what most subscribers are getting, I get the tea variation now. So the Petite boxes also include, oh, that sounds good now I will say the petite boxes get one thing that we didn't get the premier box the premier boxes got three things that you didn't get in the petite boxes so you got candy club gummy lemonade rings that has seven dollar value that sounds delicious I love gummy candy and like a lemonade one for summer sounds so so good oh my gosh I'm a little jealous I'm a little jealous of the petite boxes all right well let's go over the three things that are in the premier box that are not in the petite box all right, we got a Valkyrie candle, a foreign scented candle, soy blend. It has a 850 value. Okay, so Valkyrie, all right. It always makes me think of Wagner. So it says each candle is handmade with a soy blend wax and dye-free lead zinc-free cotton wicks. Your box will contain one of several sunny scents such as, oh goodness, you guys, I haven't looked yet. Let's see what I got. So it says you could get mimosa and mandarin, sunshine poppies, orchid, Oh, okay. Mimosa and Mandarin, Sunshine Poppies, Orchid, and Sea Salt. That's like three things in one candle. Cactus Flower, High Tides, and more. It says it has a burn time of 25 hours. So I'm going to smell it and see if I can guess what it is. You guys know I'm terrible with fragrance, so let's see. Okay. I don't think that's Mimosa and Mandarin. It could be, though. I don't think it's, I don't think it's High Tides. That's usually like a really fresh, oceany smell cactus flower no um you know it might be mimosa and mandarin because i don't think it's sunshine poppies orchid and sea salt let's find out what it is does it say you guys i don't think it says oh whew. it's mimosa and mandarin all right see i was right i was right i was like i don't know it doesn't smell super mimosa-y to me but i think i was expecting it to smell really really citrusy because mandarin and then the orange juice of a mimosa it's not super citrusy. There's definitely citrus in there, but maybe it's being sweetened by the champagne idea. So again, mimosa and mandarin is what I got. Could have gotten sunshine poppies, orchid, and sea salt all together in one. Cactus flower, I'm sure, would have been lovely, as would high tides or any of the other ones. So you guys let me know what you got from Valkyrie Candles. So they just put a little sticker on it. So mine is mimosa and mandarin. So it sounds like a brunch spot it sounds like a trendy trendy new brunch spot which man i haven't gone to brunch in a while i've been working on the weekends a lot we're going to baseball so um i'm, I'm in for brunch you guys <laughs> who wants to take me to brunch for my birthday <laughs> all right so that was lovely mm, that smells good but now i want a mimosa in my glass okay the, the next thing we got ooh, is an edible treat it's not the gummy lemonade rings but looks delicious artisanal biscotti almond bites 10 cookies seven simple ingredients only 120 calories yes and this whole container of 10 cookies is considered one serving we like that this has a value of 2.99 it says the same great tasting bite now in a convenient to go size 10 delicious bite-sized biscotti in each easy to enjoy on the go package for yourself or to share these fun 1.25 ounce packages are delightfully convenient 12 calories per cookie low sodium all natural ingredients organic and kosher certified 
Yums. That would go really well with a nice iced tea too, I will, I will say. The nice little uh, almond biscotti with your cherry coconut pineapple iced tea. That does sound really, really good actually. When I take photos, if I have time, see I'm very limited time these days, I would like to actually make that tea and enjoy those biscottis. Sounds, sounds ambitious, but you guys will have to watch my Instagram and see if I get around to actually making the tea. All right, and then finally, here's uh, the, the differentiator for the Premier and Petite Boxes, the final differentiator, I guess, which is, of course, our book. So we always get a lovely bookmark, and they're always two-sided, which I think is cool. So one side has a quote that says, we can remain shut down to our intuition, or we can open up and experience the synchronicity of life. And this is from Abby Wynn, who is, of course, the author. So that's a lovely sunset. And on the other side, we also have a tropical vibe. It says, healing means saying no when you need to say no. It means saying yes when you need to see, say yes. So it's one of those things, one of those things that you read in a book where you're like, well, yeah, obviously it's like, but it's not obvious because we struggle with it so much. So sometimes you just need someone to put it simply for you. So I love that. That's great. And then we got this book, which is called Energy Healing Made Easy. Unlock your potential as a healer. And it looks like you have this outline of a Definitely looks like a female outline with like an aura. Uh, it says it has a value of $15.99. Open yourself and others to a healing light this summer. Full of practical exercises and simple techniques for beginners, a psychotherapist reveals how you can use energy healing alongside meditation and mindfulness to heal yourself and others. In this book, energy healer and psychotherapist Abby Wynn explains the basic concepts of energy healing and gives the reader exercises and techniques for getting started right away. This book teaches the reader how to ground and center themselves, bring healing into their everyday activities to feel calmer and more balanced, open to a healing light, and send energy healing to loved ones. Now I know some of you are probably rolling your eyes a little bit. You're like, I don't know about energy healing, but you know, take it for, take it, take the opportunity to invest in these things. Just because, I mean, you know, a lot of people talk about energy healing, etc. but you also like talk about you know, treat yourself or like self care or taking some time, like taking a me day. Like that is all along the lines of energy healing, just maybe with a slightly different, a uh, little more colloquial, a little more everyday, maybe a little more accessible sort of language. Um, so I usually, you know, I know, you know, I'm a yoga teacher, but I'm usually on the side of not leaning into the things that can start to sound a little spirituality, like, you know, mystical, um, energy healing. Although I also know the benefits of all of those things too. So if you can get past your misconceptions, preconceptions about things and maybe read into it, I bet there are a lot of really good exercises in here because in all honesty, who doesn't need a little bit more grounding? Who doesn't need, let's see, we have a whole list of exercises like things, for example, they've got like the principles of energy healing. So learning a little bit more about it, but list of exercises, remembering who you really are, taking time out for healing, setting your intention. I mean, these are all things that I think that all of us could definitely apply. So it says like grounding intention for the mornings, practicing gratitude. Oh, it's like UK spelling. So this must come out of the UK. It says mindful relaxation, opening up to beauty. I mean, again, Got to get past any like misconceptions and be like, oh, it sounds a little like new agey or something. We all need energy healing, right? We all need a little bit more energy and we all need a little bit more healing. So why not allow those to be combined? I know I'm bad about reading books like this, but it is pretty skinny. So maybe I'll be able to flip through and find some things like creating a space of love and then giving you an, a nice exercise. So look how easy it is. It's just like a quick little read and then some bullet points for the exercise. So maybe not so bad, right? This is the kind of thing that I think is really nice to receive in a box along with some treats, along with some self-care, some skincare, along with a nice tea or coffee that you can take the time. Even that meditative time of preparing your tea or your coffee can really be that little oasis in your day that you absolutely need. And that is what Tea, Pray, Love really gives us the permission and the tools to achieve in our life on an every other month basis, which is not enough, but definitely helps. You guys, let me know what you thought about this box. I think it's great. I love all the summery bright colors. I love how they took it took into account what 
season it is and um, again I just think the value is really fantastic so a little sad about the gummy lemonade rings not gonna lie excited about the biscotti bites that we got instead very excited about this mask very excited about the body scrub love the mimosa candle but I want to hear what you guys thought uh, what is your favorite and what do you do for your energy healing what is your sort of allowance that you give yourself not just general self-care like be specific in the comments below i'd love to hear from you maybe you'll give me some good ideas and maybe you'll give some other people some good ideas as well i hope you enjoyed this video if you did help me out with a thumbs up and i will see you all very very soon in my next unboxing